Welcome back into the show. We are here with our friends from Uncle Joe's Woodshed. We've got Kathy and Tim here. And Tim, you just informed me, you guys are, you're the third generation uh, owner of Uncle Joe's Woodshed. Well, we're, yeah, we're, um, we're the, the family, we're, it's a corporation actually, but yeah. we're, we've been uh, family run by Uncle Joe's family and the Baker family since its conception. My grandfather and Uncle Joe started the company uh, you know, some over 67 years ago, and here we still are here, for, hopefully for another 67 years. So. That is amazing. We're talking Uncle Joe was a real person. Was a real Uncle person. Uncle Joe was real. A lot of people ask about it. His <laughs> name was Joe Anderson. He lived in Lock Haven. He started the store in Lock Haven first, and then two years later, my grandfather moved down to Altoona, and uh, the rest is history. Yes, so. and his legacy is living on. Kathy, you married into this. I did. And um, for people that have been, so you're, you're also part of, um, you know, I guess free, free labor, doing all the things that, uh, you know, you need to do. You, you were the mastermind, too, behind the decorating, which is just incredible. Okay. Um, you guys just truly do an amazing job. And this is just a taste, though, of what is to find, be found in store. Oh, yeah. Um, There's so much, so much stuff in the store. For people who've never been out, though, what, what can they expect when they walk in? You can really find a little bit of anything, to be honest I mean, with you. Yeah. A lot of people think that it's a wood shop because of the uh -huh. name. It's amazing how many people we've been here for over 65 years and people still have never been to the store because they think it's a woodworking store. Uncle Joe's slogan back in the day was, you won't find everything, but you might find anything. Mm -hmm. So really anything at the That's woodshed, cute. you know, from from socks to, you know, huge Christmas trees, yeah. you know, it's, we, we really do have anything. everything. Yes. yes, and which is, you guys uh, decided, you know, we're doing, we're going to be do, doing several holiday segments here, and this is a great one too, holiday gift ideas. These are all for under $10. We were talking too, when you're buying for a lot of different people, it really adds up. So these little bits and pieces that you can just kind of pick up for different people is really a great way to go. Tell me what you brought along with you today. Okay, so I I think, honestly, I would love to start with here. those. Yeah, the tinsel teasers. We got those and a couple other games from the same company and played them when my family was in town. And we never laughed so hard. I mean, we had a ball. And that comes with a little puzzle and a game. So okay. if you don't yeah. have somebody maybe to play the card game with, you still have a little puzzle you can Yeah, play nice with. little stocking stuffer. You could hang it on the tree like an ornament and somebody could find it whenever they find the pickle, which we brought a pickle today. So everybody, we were telling people about the woodshed pickles and the tradition of hiding the pickle that's on the Christmas funny. tree. The pickles are all glass and they're they're under ten dollars also. So oh, that's really cool, and that's kind of a German holiday. It, that's where it originated. Yep, that's yep. Where it came and from. Um, yeah, kids love that too, finding the pickle. And I love that idea. Different games, card sets, puzzles, all in that little little box. All in that little box. Yeah, hard to believe it, but that's hey, loads of fun. We love that. Okay, what else here? Well, we have these paint by numbers and color by, you know, color by numbers with pencils, um, you know, for kids or for adults. All of these are wow. under ten dollars. That's a great item for people. Um, we tried to bring something from every department, so you can see it's just, just not, you know, home decor mm -hmm. stuff, not just plushies. You know, this is from our hobby department. Um, we have stuff like fishing baits in our sporting goods department. Mm -hmm. Some of them locally made by like 412 or Scared Fishless, who are up in Portage. Um, you know, those are all under ten bucks. Just, just something in every single department for everybody yes. at, at that price range. The whole family can go in and find something. That is Absolutely. correct. Absolutely, yep. yes. Yep. And these have Ooh. been wildly favorite items. How sweet. They're name books. So they we have, have a bunch of different names. <laughs> There's a whole mess of names. And honestly, you can't always find the name you're looking for. Mm -hmm. I, but for those, we have Special Daughter. daughter special And yes. there's some that are blank that you can write the name into okay. the story if Book you want to. You. Yeah, that's that right. is a really neat idea. We see these kind of pop up to, to you know, help the kiddos feel incorporated in the story. Yep. Absolutely. They love to see their name in a story. We have those uh, pom pals that we were looking at. You know, yes. those have been a big thing. And these are just the holiday ones. We have, Look, we have everyday sweet. ones also. There's Grinch. Uh, <laughs> Kathy has a dreidel over there. We brought a little fruit cake. Um, you, you know, th but there's oh also regular everyday characters that, and yeah. Pom Pals have been just huge, and they're, again, under $10. That is really incredible. I know my sisters, the younger generation, they love these little things. It's always something, you know, every year there's a, a new toy or something to squish on, you know, and they love it, which That's is right. kind of brings me to this. I've never seen these. So those, huh. it's neato. So it's just something that you can kind of... Like Smush. a sensory, yeah. sensory kind of thing, okay? Holiday stress relief. And honestly, once you open those and you start playing with them, they're really hard to put down. <laughs> I love that. Hey, anything to keep the kids occupied. That's or right. even, hey, the adults too. I know. My, right. my son's 19, and if you go into our Logan Valley Mall store, sometimes you'll see him juggling those. 
that just you can do all kinds of stuff oh, with Oh, that's them. fun. Yeah. Okay, yep. some things for the kitchen, the home here too. Absolutely. I mean, we have tea towels and some sponges. They're all Best under $20 is? and everybody really loves to do the dishes. Yeah. So, <laughs> why not make yeah. it really fun? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they got to get done somehow. So. That's true. We have those wooden Might spoons well. over there that have um, engravings oh, on wow. them. Those are actually done locally here. A uh, gentleman does those in Altoona and brings them and sells them in our store along with other wooden signs. That's so cool. Um, Grandma's kitchen. Yep. And then we have these Thompson melts over here, yes. uh, which a lot of people know. Those are local, made in Huntington, PA. So, you know, they, they smell awesome. Those are, yes. I think, you know, that's the Christmas the tree, which, which is awesome. And oh, then Grandma's, yeah. Grandma's that's, that's always a popular yum, one. Yum. So. Yum. And then we have a, a bunch of different pet things. You know, we have the socks there, but we also have 20 and 30 ounce tumblers and... There's a whole pet tree over at the store. Yeah, like there is some, I mean... Ornaments and picks and anything you could possibly imagine. Unique things, imagine. too. I think you can't just find anywhere else. I, I told you last time you were here, the early, earlier this week, the Webkins. Which oh, have yeah. made a comeback. We have Webkins next right now. Uh, we also have, it's the 30th anniversary of Beanie Babies. Okay. Uh, so we have, you know, we, we sell them like instantly when we get them. We actually do have some right now. Um, Ty was very n nice to uh, send us extra. I'm probably not supposed to say that. Yeah. But, but, uh, you got lots but, of inventory. <laughs> but yeah, hey. we're, we're, uh, we're, we're only supposed to get so many, and we actually got a little bit more than what we were supposed to oh, get, so we're very thankful. I do, yeah. Well, when you do this for 30 years, you, you meet some people. I can <laughs> so. imagine. Uh, so if people want to make their way out, maybe they've never been, or say, hey, they think you're a wood shop, and they need to come and check out the store for themselves and see it in person, where are you guys located? What's the best way to find you? We are in the Pleasant Valley Shopping Center. Yes. Um, 3415. Yep. And then right we're in also in the, in the Logan Valley Mall. Yeah, okay. we're in Altoona. Valley and then we have a, a location in Lock Haven, Pennsylvania, mm -hmm. like we talked about earlier. That's up and, in my neck of the woods. Yeah, and you can always shop online at ujwoodshed.com. Wow. And, you know, a lot of stuff that we have here, we have, you know, we put on Facebook and Feature, which also has a link to the website. So. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Tim and Kathy, thank you all so much for stopping by. Thank you. Thank look you. forward to having you back for more festivities and holiday fun. We'll be back after a quick commercial break, but stay tuned for this.